All right, so today I'm gonna go ahead and answer a viewer question that I got uh, just yesterday. And it says, hi, Michael. First, I'm French, so sorry if I'm making English mistakes. <laughs> I just purchased the JVC LS300 and I have one question. How do you manage your audio? I have a shotgun and a wireless system, both plugged into the XLR of the camera. Then on Premiere, I only have one stereo track with my shotgun on the left and my lav on the right. Do you know a way to get different, to get two different stereo tracks? Thanks. Okay, so this is from Charles and um, yes, I do know how to do that Charles. I'm gonna explain it to you right now. And I thought this was a really good question because this doesn't really only work for this particular camera, pretty much will work for any camera that has two channels on it or even if it doesn't have two channels on it and it's, uh, you have some type of lavalier system like this one that has two transmitters but one receiver, um, this basically will send uh, one transmitter to the left and the other one to the right. So now when you're in Premiere or whatever editing software you're using, you only have one track, but you might want to control the volume or add an effect to only one of those uh, left or right channels at a time because you just want to affect one person. So that's pretty much what you're getting at and I totally understand why. So basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna go into Premiere, you're going to go into your project folder and whatever file you have that audio on, you're gonna right click on it. And just as a quick side note, you can see here that I'm selecting multiple clips. You don't have to do this to one clip at a time, you could do it to a bunch. So just select a group and then right click. You're gonna to go to modify and then go to audio channels. And then in audio channels, you're gonna see there that one clip with the left and the right where you have the number of tracks it just has a one change it to two once you put a two in that field you'll get two different tracks now so in that first track you're going to take um both of the check boxes and move them to the left in the second clip that was just just created when you put the number two in there move both of those check marks to the right now when you drag that clip to your timeline instead of having one track you'll have two you just got to make sure, though, that you um, have uh, both of those tracks enabled because if you don't have them enabled, then you just get the one. But one is going to be really what's on the left. The other one is going to be what's on the right. And you can control those independently, raising volume, keyframing, adding different audio effects to one and not the other. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to separate those tracks so that you know that what I'm telling you is right. So you can, you can kind of tell. Just gotta prove myself so you don't think I'm lying to you. But this is how you would do it. So we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna separate those tracks so that you know that what I'm telling you is right. So you can, can kind of tell. Just gotta prove myself so you don't think I'm lying to you. But this is how you would do it. So there you have it. So that's how you would separate your tracks and you would be able to control your left and your right independently, adding whatever effects you need. If you found that helpful, please go ahead and like this video. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. I'm not sure why you haven't, but make sure you go ahead and do that and share this with anybody else who you think may find this helpful. Also, there's gonna be some affiliate links down below for Adobe Premiere if you haven't already used that software or purchased that software. It's what I used to make all these YouTube videos and edit every single video that I've ever done, really has been Adobe Premiere. Also, the music that you're hearing in the background is provided by Soundstripe.com, which I've been using for years now for all of my wedding videos, for uh, a lot of the background music that you hear in these YouTube videos. It's a great site, great music. And if you go ahead and check them out, using my affiliate link and then using my discount code down below, you'll get 10% off. So, you're welcome. But anyway, as always, I'm Mike Turner. Thanks for watching, and I guess I'll see you soon.